We're here with uh, Ashton Emery, Rockwell running back. Uh, man, first off, congratulations once again on the big uh, team victory yesterday versus Waxahachie. Area champions, uh, congratulations. I, I got to know, how are you feeling after a physical game like that? I'm feeling good. You know, I got to get treatment today, so I'm feeling better than what I felt yesterday. I want to know what your approach was th this off offseason, uh, you know, in preparing for the season and, and just – Getting ready to uh, to to take on uh, you know your senior year, you know just what what was it uh, you know that you found? What was the key to uh, to get ready for this year? It was um it was film, 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 film. I had I sat down with my brother. I watched film all summer, and I um I seen I made so many many little mistakes last year, and I was like, well, if I fix those mistakes, I'll be a way better back. So I came into this season. I fix those mistakes and I watch film a lot. This uh, this running back group, you know, it's it's a special group. Um, and, and I got to ask, what what has Coach Meyer meant to the success of you you guys have had this season? Same with Coach Meyer. He, I mean, man, he he been on this, but we we taking in his love. We know he loves us, and he's just been um he been like a father figure to all of us. He's just a great he's a great person, great coach, and we love him. He's yeah, he's been great. It's been rumored that uh, that he's the reason that you you have that spin move. Uh, is that is that something he he put in he put in uh, for you? <laughs> yeah, we, we work on it every day, every day. <laughs> last year, last year it was my go-to move, but it didn't work well. It worked, <laughs> good spin move. So I didn't hit it at all. Um, this year until that game, and it, it worked. It worked out. I'm gonna I'm gonna mention some names. And I want to tell you, I want you to tell me the first thing that comes to mind when I when I mention this name. Um, let's start with uh, Chase uh, Wuzne. Here, dog. I love him, young dog. Uh, let's let's try another one. Cameron Johnson. Dog, another one. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's keep it because if, if anybody notices, we're having a theme here. This is the starting five, the O line here. Uh, Chris Green. Dog, another one. <laughs> Uh, ben Billings, oh, Billings, a dog, another and, dog, and and finally Michael Wells. I mean uh, the leadership that he brings. That's my that's my right hand man. That's my captain. He's a dog too. They all dogs, pure dogs. Wouldn't want nobody else. Special group, uh, and obviously uh, the success that you guys are having uh, this year. They're a big part of it, obviously. Who is Ashton Emery? Like you know, who are you off the field? You know, and and what what other things do you like to do? Man, a lot of people don't know. I be singing. I love to sing. <laughs> I love to sing. I dance. I like to have fun. I like to be with friends. I'm a funny guy. I'm a I'm a character. Uh, some say the class clown, but you know, I'm just I'm just a I got to be around. I can't let you off the hook. You said sing. What? what give me give me give me give me give me five seconds. Give me three I seconds. Hey. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, but like, if you were if you were gonna sing, what what's like what's your genre? Um, nineties music, R and B. All right, I love it. I love it. Uh, a little key sweat. Yes, sir. Uh, <laughs> all right, all right. I can I can I can get down with it. Uh, that's kind of my my era. This um, game the yesterday, you know, um, you know, obviously, it, I, it was funny when when we were talking. We did an interview yesterday on the field, and I'm kind of having to redo it because the sound wasn't very good. Uh, I mentioned uh, 270 yards rushing, uh, and you you were you were surprised, you were shocked. Over 270 yards, four touchdowns. Uh, just that look on your face. What was it about that that, that kind of surprised you? It was man, that's 270. That's a lot. A lot, a lot of a lot of kids don't get 270 yards in one game. And I was just I was just thankful for my old line for blocking for me the whole night, whole day. It was just shocking to me. Actually, it was very shocking. It, it was an emotional win for you guys, for the team. Um, what about yesterday meant the most to you? Um, I have to say, talking to Chris Green, you know, he done, he done been through a lot of things this past year. And he had told me he was doing it for his dad. So I was like, I'm here with you. We're going to get past it together. And it just meant a lot to him. So it meant a lot to me, too. Your role on this team, I mean, you guys, this is an offense that's uh, full of playmakers. I mean, there, there's guys all over the place. What is it, you know, about uh, this team that's just like, that's, that's just has this selfless attitude? I mean, this this group of kids is just, it's a powerful group. When you got people who just not, here, I want ball, I want ball, I want ball. We play better as a team. 
they said they we separate the ball. We can throw it downfield. We can um we can run the ball. You put Parker in, he can run the ball. You put Jameer in, he can run the ball. Meeks, he can run the ball. Brewer, he can run the ball. Latham, he can run the ball. We got so many um we got so many people that's behind us that that know how to play their role and do their job, and we're all good at it. After you scored a touchdown, um, you, you went, you sat down for like two seconds, and then you walked over to the to the O line bench, and uh, you know you just made it a point to to talk to each and every one of them. And coach was in the middle of maybe about to coach them up, but you made it a point to just talk to each and one of them, and, and you know uh, give them a little high five and, and just you know keep them motivated. Uh, where does that come from? Where, where does that you know that leadership you know that that come from? They're my O linemen. Without them, I wouldn't have 274 yards. So it's just I gotta make sure I always give them their props and let them know that I'm right beside them through every step. There's still a lot of work to be done. Obviously, there, there's there's bigger goals uh, than than the area championship. Uh, but it, to this point, uh, what, what's what's been uh, your 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 best game? You know, you, something that, that's like, man, that that was it right there. That was. That was uh, one of one of my best moments of my high school career. I can honestly say I had I had um, games where I scored a lot. I had um, games I had a lot of yards. But I feel like my, my most game. I asked my teammates, and they, everybody felt like it was the horn game. It came down to the last second, and they they called my name, and I showed up, and um, we won the game. So I feel like I played my heart out during horn game, and it was it was it was a lot going on, and I. I fought through it, so. JFND, it's in the back on that board up there. What, what does that mean to you? Jackie fights never die. You, um, yesterday we was we was down, we was down at the beginning of the half. They ain't changed nothing for us. They ain't changed nothing. It was so many games we have been down. We got like prosper game, fourth and fourth and ten. Um, we got to go make a play. Land and roll out, throw it to Gooch. We go score, we win the game. It's plays like that horn game. Fifteen seconds left on the clock. I get to the one yard line. We put the we get the ball in the end zone. It's just so many so many times we have been in a in a situation where we have to keep fighting and we don't give up. And that's what JFND means. It's jacket fights never die, and we ain't died yet. And I don't think no defense in the state can stop us. Never grit. You know what what's the message been uh, from the coaches and, and the team and uh, the buy in uh, and you know what the word grit means to you. The way that we've been playing as a team and the way that we've been coming together is just it means a lot. And it's just, it's like it's so many people on the team, and everybody knows they play their part. Like we got scout team, they dogs. We need we need them scout team players at practice to give us a great look. They always give us great looks. We got stars on it. You got stars on the team where it can. You know, some people want balls, some people don't. It's just like you can't. There is nobody on the team that's like. I can I put there's nobody on our team that's just. A gimme a gimme type of guy. It's just like the grit that we have is just we're just a family. Uh, Twelve games, uh, eighteen uh, over eighteen hundred rushing yards, uh, over twenty two hundred uh, all purpose yards, nine point yards, uh, nine point eight yards per carry, uh, twenty four touchdowns. Um, but I feel like I feel like you know that that doesn't tell the whole story of you, Ashton. I think uh, your leadership. Um, how you carry yourself, and you know how you're trying to make the guys around you better. Uh, you know the, those aren't those aren't things that are in the numbers, and uh, it's uh, it's been really cool to see you operate. Uh, Ashton, uh, man, I wish you all the best, man. Uh, uh, I, I do have to ask you. I did have one other one other question. Where does the the uh, the arrow the, uh, celebration come from? What, 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 when you pull the arrow back and you shoot it, where does that come from? Uh, I came up with that. I got to be honest. I came up with that. It was cause we was playing the Indians. I'm like, it's an arrow thing. So what I was gonna do, I was every time I scored, I was gonna show him we here, and we we came to win. So I shot my arrow at him. Man, uh, you did, and you shot it well. Uh, you you ran the ball well. I uh, I enjoyed um, you know watch looking at the videos and just uh, playing them. I I wish I could just release all of them in slow motion because that's that's where it's fun because you just kind of see all the little things that maybe you don't see when it's all sped up. Uh, but some of the things uh, that were going on and in the interior of the line for you to be able to bounce outside and, and do your thing, um, it was it was fun to watch. Uh, good luck to you this week, man. Uh, I know you guys got another uh, big test. I know you guys don't want to quit playing uh, ball. Uh, you know, just uh, get get some rest. Uh, enjoy your Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. And, uh, we'll, we'll talk again soon, okay? I appreciate everything. Thank you. All right. Have a good one. Thanks.